and welcome to a Saturday Grid from Bavaria. And it's early in the morning, so we're not winding down today. We're winding up for the day and therefore having some Sprudelwasser, or uh, in English, some seltzer water, carbonated water, soda water, with a splash of apple cider vinegar because it's good for my microbiota and also controls glucose spikes. I'm not even diabetic, but why mess with them? And after a while, the taste, you get used to it. Um, in fact, I kind of look forward to it every day. So, Shotzi is uh, in her proper place behind me. Like, that's a thing. Uh, sometimes she does this like I'm a, I'm a Hindu deity with my all these hands behind me. Yeah, <laughs> there it is. So, no. I'm going to convince her one day to join me here at the table. She's the brains anyway. So, let's see what we got here. So, uh, today we've got a Saturday Grid by Sam uh, Azerski and edited by Joel Fagliano. He's doing a fabulous job in Mr. Will Short's absence. Let's jump into this grid. See what we got. Am I going to be sitting here for four hours making a fool of myself, or are we going to get this done today? Um, they're seen around diners. Tips. Uh, like Beth among the March sisters. Yeah, he thinks he's the shyest. Mm -hmm. Species named for its squarish shape. Sizzling. How about sexy? Extra security. Mm -hmm. Limerick group. Go with Irish on this one, I guess. I don't know. This is not looking like it's going to be a breeze through for us today. Troy setting. Okay, I don't know. I mean, Troy, New York. Troy is in, you know, the Trojan War. Who knows? It's just dough. And let's see. No, I don't think this is right. Because I think this is a box fish, and uh, I don't know what else it could be, to be honest with you. Uh, a species named for its squarish shape. I mean, I uh, could put SpongeBob in there. Maybe it is it bibs? That's no diners don't wear bibs. I mean, perhaps maybe at a lobster. Maybe at a lobster diner. I mean, I don't think this is well the H. I mean, cause now I'm like, well, because I think this is bussing now. Ah, and you gotta spell it right. gonna be one of my days here. It is too early for this crap. So, so is this Smack's forehead? Gah? Gah! Gah! I mean, I mean, it's dough, right? You know, you think Homer Simpson, dough? You know, gah? We haven't said gah in years. I mean, I don't think I've ever even said it. No, we don't. No one says dough except for Homer. Right, that's true. Uh... <laughs> Yep, totally feel that. Uh, maybe I hear you. Worrisome word from a barber. Uh oh. That seems like that seems like two words to me. I hear ya. And this looks like New York State. That's okay. Egg-shaped brain structures. Well, as a, I guess I should move the puzzle back. As a cognitive scientist, I think with a. Medical surgical nurse sitting right behind me. We should probably get this one right. I think these are thalami. Th 
Thalamine. Okay, bring around extra security, maybe a safety net. Maybe a safety net. Speaking volumes. A response akin to says who? Ambassador cut. I think that's a, is it a New York strip or a strip steak or. Uh, let's see. Uh, big name in trucks, I think, could be Ryder. I'm trying to, if you're wondering, I'm trying to work in, uh, figure out if this is strip steak or if it's like a something else. I think it's a strip steak. I, I, just, I, I blush to say that I don't know much about cuts of meat. I, I just don't. Um, I discovered early on that both Shotzi and I love uh, filet mignon. So obviously tenderloin is a big thing for us. And uh, but prime rib, don't really care for it. It's always really marbly and grisly. Ugh, I just don't. So yeah. So um, let's see. So bring around is probably to sway. I think this is looking like it could be very well strip steak. Activist born at 375 ppm per her social media bio. And I'm not sure what uh, 375 pages per minute or points per minute or what the ppm even stands for. But I think this is Greta Thunberg. Uh, this is context clues because it seems like the kind of thing she would do. And I, I just love the living daylights out of her. Um, really support her activism. My goodness. Well, I don't like Lord. Uh, I mean, maybe Lordy. Lassitude is probably torpor. Oh, but I never liked that word. It's it's okay to write, use it in like fiction or writing a report or something. But I don't like to say it. Torpor. Cleveland. Well, let's see. It's a big city in Ohio, but I think we're talking about Grover as in his party. He was a Democrat. Grant or Benjamin may be a large bill. Um, slack. Maybe limp. That's in L. Oh, so Lyra? Turkey bacon is in money in Turkey. First of all, I don't like the idea that we're still spelling turkey this way. So I'm, I'm going to spell it out. Uh, well, no, I can't because I don't have no way to really do it here for you. But Turkey is what they want to be called because that's what their actual name is. And I don't think anybody there really wants to be referred to as, you know, a, a gobble gobble animal or how we sometimes use it in kind of a negative way. You know, oh, it's turkey talk, you know. So, I mean, it'd be nice if we could just kind of maybe respect their wishes to a degree. Uh, I'm going to go with limp for slack, though that seems... When I hear limp, I'm thinking little blue pill problems for people. End of discussion. Period. Resort that prohibits snowboarding. Yeah, and I know this because I've just seen this. I don't know. I don't snowboard. I can't remember. Advice to move on. Maybe let it go. Maybe, 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 maybe not. Grievance. Looks like it could be a plaint. Um, is it Alta? I think it is because, yes, fathers in Hebrew. Abbas. Dead language miners unite! Yeah! Picture of Pluto, perhaps. I don't know. It probably could be a cell, maybe. I'm thinking like Disney, Pluto. I'm thinking the actual drawing. And when you're doing animations, which I've done, uh, you start with an each is an individual cell. And I get a C E L. Let's see if this works for us because I think I'm getting a little too gutsy here. Modern money kiosk. Well, we've got this bit here. So I'm going to go with Bitcoin, maybe ATM. I've never seen one. I've never even heard of that before. But I had the bit and the C. So I felt, I felt like I had the license to go. 
uh, Venezuela landmark that's the tallest of its kind in, a, in the world. It's like, the, is that Angels Falls or something? Um, looked quickly. Stole a, a peak. Cry of encouragement, maybe ole, 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 ole. I had that uh, the other day when it was uh, some people out there. He doesn't use he hot, hot, hot. What? It is, isn't it? Yeah, blank girl isn't pretty. Funny girl. Oh, I love Barbara Streisand, and I love this movie. I just love her to death. So if a girl ain't pretty, if a girl isn't pretty, she's excuse me. Yeah, I think this is Angel Falls. I've never been to Venezuela, so you know I can't say for sure. Take as a pointer. Veteran. NFL quarterback whose name anagrams to something. Now, see, if I were doing this just for me, this is where I'd stop. And I would just sit and drive shots crazy while I figured out the veteran NFL quarterback whose name anagrams to something. Why? Because it's there. It's just, they gave you the answer. It's just not in the right order, right? So I think that's awesome. Bench cover. Um. <laughs> a robe? <laughs> Let's get some of our doubts here. Let me see if something will help me with this. Ease, you know. Looks like be gentle. Be gentle. City of one plus million, million near the Russia Kazakhstan border. Oh, I've been there. That's Omsk. I'm there in Almaty. Spent some time in Bishkek. Uh, Kyrgyzstan, the whole area there. Had a lot of fun running around in the Ural Mountains. It was great stuff. It better call. I think this is Geno Smith. That was kind of on my tongue. Blank Street Musical Festival, Beale Street. So I think, oh look, take as a pointer. This is clever. Dog nap. It's a dog nap. I mean, because you're going to see, stole a peak, which is what I do sometimes when she's in the shower. Like, hmm. Dog nap. And, uh, well, I mean, you've been married to a pretty girl for 33 years. I mean, it's pretty, I take advantage of it. Uh, would you mind? Um, bowl full, often served with bean sprouts. Oh my gosh, again, because I am the pho king. Just not anymore. Though I have learned how to use molecular gastronomy to create spaghetti noodles out of a can of chicken. And some fish algae, but you know, don't worry about that stuff. I've been getting the molecular gastronomical uh, ingredients from a laboratory in Italy, right? Uh, so sodium alginate is like, I need, uh, per favore, sodio alginato. You know, it's kind of, <laughs> uh, it's funny. All right, I, I, I cracked myself up. Well, speaking of Italy, yours in Torino, duo. I love Italian because it's so emotional. It's just so dramatic. It just bouncy, bouncy consonants and stuff. It, it's a, uh, you know, call me Cristoforo, right? So how are you doing today, Christopher, right? You know, sto malissimo. Just to say I'm having a bad day, right? You know, it's all just, oh, mamma mia, sto malissimo. Or, io sto bene, bene. You know, it's always happy or I'm just crushed. And I love that. Okay, let's see. Declaim. First of all, this is looking more and more like response akin to says who is why should I? Do you hear it? Do you hear it in my voice? I'm getting a little bit more confident as we're kind of slipping through this thing. And we're already at almost 13 minutes, so... Speaking volumes look like audio books, something I think my dear Shotzi behind me knows something about. Um, she loves listening to books. I prefer to read them, but if I'm driving, I don't mind listening. Well, you should have whatever you want. I will do my best to make sure that happens. Declaim, I think we're talking about an elocute. Elocute. Trace of music. Well, this is Trace Atkins, I guess. Well, I would have preferred the diet guy, right? You know, 
Trace Atkins. But I do like the guy. I mean, uh, he's always hanging out with, like, Bill Maher. And if you're a friend of Bill Maher's, we're probably going to be friends. I mean, well, we could be friends. Lead into male or female, probably cis and easily crushable. Looks like it's going to be puny. And here we go. So I think we, we might have broken through some of the more challenging areas. we got a lot of stuff to work with on crosses and downs, so I feel really better about this puzzle. 2022 rom-com with a predominantly LGBTQ cast, and I don't know for sure. I think it'd be bros. I, I haven't watched it, and I probably wouldn't. I don't have anything against it. I just don't. I, I like to watch movies and shows about a long time ago with lots of earls and dukes and counts and stuff, and I kind of just imagine myself being there. So I'm very excited about the new Downton Abbey movie coming out. Standards of purity, I think. So this is probably, this. It, it, is it okay? Would you mind? Is it okay? Because I think these are carrots. My wife hates how I say carrots. So I try to say carrots. I have to make myself say carrots. Anyways, I, she's making fun of me the other day when I was talking about eating out on the terrace. You know, so, okay, I don't know. I, w I was born and raised in Texas, but I was predominantly raised uh, by thick, German accent women, so uh, I don't think I really have an accent. Uh, Blink Cat, Holiday Creature, and Icelandic Folklore. I know this. It's the Yule Cat. Uh, so we got a Paul here. Gloomy Atmosphere. That would be it. They may come with opinions. How about rulings? Um, get Hitched. Say I do. Prefix in some health product names. Medi. Way up in the mountain. So, so we got a. Uh, this is a D. A fabric name for Midi's capital. This is Damask. And, um. You, know, you, you could. I mean, I've been all over the Middle East too, but you know what? I can't say I've had the most fun there. Love Turkey. Turkey. Hill adjacent fill, uh, field in brief. Let's see, print source, uh, legit, plates for nuts, plates for nuts. Uh, I'm gonna go with a paw here because I always, my mind works like I'm looking at three different clues at once trying to work it out. I'm always doing that. So I think plates for nuts may be washers and if that is so, and I think up, uh, way up in the mountains uh, is gondola, and because that's how we get up there, right? Uh, but my preferred term is funicular, probably because no one knows what it means, and that makes me happy. Rubs the wrong way, galls. Aha, galling of you, sir. Shall we pistols at dawn? Another gall. Off the court memoirist, 1981. Well, as a matter of fact, my license plates here in Germany are personalized to Arthur Ashe because I'm a big fan. So I got Ash 297. It just came that way, but I was able to draw a, a mnemonic device immediately. Ash 297. Lastin line. Lastin line. So hill adjacent field is probably poli sci. Political scientist back here. Summa cum laude graduate. Yeah, baby. Me? <laughs> D equals degree. Woo. That was me. Uh, so legit, maybe all that. And the last in line is also very clever. This is a scar. I love that. Um, and baby raccoons are kits, and that's also, incidentally, my uh, nickname in Vietnamese. Die de la kit. Kit. That's my, that's Christopher, that's a shortened version of Christopher in Vietnamese. So, uh, uh, let's see, did I even turn on the speaker? Because, I mean, if we did okay, if we screwed something up, then, let's see, so kits. How do we do, Bob? How did, how did we do, Bob? So if I wasn't yammering on, I probably would have been even longer because I'd still be looking at that something 
clue. Uh, but 1753 is not bad for Saturday. Um, I'm kind of surprised that uh, that it's that it, yeah. Anyway, so uh, as always, remember. Uh, go out of your way to make someone's day and one of the nicest ways you can do that is to uh, try to speak to immigrants in their native language because they could really use a little bit of uh, you know uh, an ole of course right so of some sort right you know some kind of encouragement you know let them know that, that you care so learn it so you know basic stuff Alfie de saying au revoir arrivederci adios aloha Ciao, shalom, maslamati, anyang hiaseo, tambien. See you next time. And I'm going to finish my vinegar water. Cheers. <laughs>